making history right here in Luzerne County as the first female black student enrolled in the surveying engineering program at Penn State Wilkesbury campus. 2822 News reporter I.E. Jine heads out to campus to learn more about this international student's interesting journey to her new career. Farina Lake's path to surveying engineering was not a typical one. She earned three associate's degrees, one in geography, one in physics, and another in biology in her home country of Dominica, an island country in the Caribbean. Lake wondered what she could do with the degrees. Afterward, I researched what can I do with the degrees that I have already, mm -hmm. and that's how I found out about surveying engineering because it's very physics and geography intensive. She decided to attend Penn State Wilkesbury campus, but but first had to deal with some challenges. I had to delay my acceptance um, because I had issues getting my visa. So that was the battle. And when I did finally come, I came in as a sponsored student. The next struggle, tuition. My home country was paying for my tuition. And then it, there was a struggle with that because unfortunately the payments were not always made on time. And so that caused Let's just say I was at the Bursar's office a lot. But she persevered. Her professors were very understanding and allowed her to sit in on classes. And it was all worth the effort. In May, Lake will be the first black female student to graduate from the survey engineering program at Penn State Wilkesbury campus. Wow, I remember the first time that it was said to me, and it was actually the Director of Student Affairs, Ms. Wanda Oche, who told me, and I was in disbelief. A lot of different mix of emotions. I was happy, of course. Um, I felt honored to be the first. And, and then the other side of that was, I just wish I could share it. Like, it's nice to be the first, but I wish that there was a second or a third black woman that I could identify. She offers this advice to others. Just because you'll be the first doesn't mean that it can't be done. So you're probably the one who has to be the first to inspire other people to let them know that yes, that they can, that they can do it. Lake is also a part of organizations on campus and says the relationship she's built here helped her get through the tough days. Although her journey has not been an easy one, she thanks God and the support of staff members at Penn State Wilkesbury campus like Wanda Uche. Celebrating Black History in Luzerne County, I'm I.E. Jang, 2822 News.